I'm Debbie Spencer of the Debbie Spencer Group. Enjoy this tour of Bedford. Bedford, Massachusetts, a small 14 square mile suburban town, located 15 miles northwest of Boston. Nestled between the historic towns of Lexington and Concord, Bedford is home to numerous historical sites. People over the generations have done a lot to preserve the character and a lot of the old historic buildings in Bedford and our efforts now are focused on trying to maintain those historic buildings and to give people a sense of the history of the town so they can appreciate it and help to carry the message to future generations. The history around Fawn Lake goes back to the Civil War era. There had been a small hotel there, Bedford Springs Hotel, which was purchased by a Dr. Hayden, and he had Fawn Lake dug out by immigrant laborers, so it's one of the largest uh, man-made lakes in the state. Located conveniently only feet from Fawn Lake is the popular Minuteman Bikeway, an 11-mile path that runs from Bedford to the Alewife Tea Stop in Cambridge and is accessible year-round. Chip and Farm, a favorite of Bedford, Family owned and operated, the farm offers many local products. For a fun outing with the kids, visit their petting zoo. Feed the pigs, sheep, chickens, cow, bunnies, and goats with vegetable scraps provided free by the farm. Chip and Farm also hosts birthday parties and farm classes. Bedford's a small town and really easy to get around. Me and my friends bike everywhere. Just down the road from Chip and Farm, you will find the Edge Sports Center a state-of-the-art recreational facility for athletes of all ages. The facility is anchored with two modern ice hockey rinks, two year-round turf athletic fields, and a state-of-the-art athletic training center. We have a lot of job opportunities for kids in high school. It's a small town, so everyone's looking out for each other. And it's a safe environment for everybody. Small town with a small town feel, very safe town. It's a great sense of community. Everyone, everyone kind of knows everyone and friendly people. The Bedford school system is a, a huge draw for people to want to live here. There are two elementary schools, one middle school, and one high school in Bedford. In recent years, Bedford has been rated by Boston Magazine as one of the top 10 high schools in Massachusetts. With our concern for the health and well-being of our own children and the health and well-being of each other, I think this is a darn good community. There are lots of opportunities for extracurricular activities such as art, drama, and sports. Located directly next to the high school are the town's turf field, track, and tennis courts, used for numerous sports and events throughout the year. The Bedford Free Public Library accommodates collections for Bedford patrons of all ages. As part of the Minuteman Library Network, it offers computers, internet access, and other online services. Preserved within the library is the Bedford flag, the oldest known flag in the United States. Daniel evidently grabbed up this old flag that his family had fought so bravely under and took it with him to the Concord Bridge where he fought on April 19th. Springs Brook Park, a local man-made swimming pond with a sandy beach, water park, and concessions. I love that there are lots of restaurants and Bedford Farms. <laughs>